hello you are welcome here yeah, let's solve this nice exponential equation and we are finding the value of a and b from here the right hand side is of course a positive number so this implies that 6 raised to power a should be greater than 6 raised to power b and uh, if this is the case it implies here that a is also greater than b then that means a can be written as b plus a number which is let's represent as letter k so a can be written as b plus k then we can write this equation in terms of uh, b and k and uh, this will be 6 raised to power bk now b plus k instead of a 6 raised to power b plus k minus 6 raised to power b is now equals to 1260 from here then from the law of indices let's rewrite this and uh, this will give us 6 raised to power b then multiply by 6 raised to power k then minus 6 raised to power b equals to 1260 then from here we have 6 raised to power b common let's factor it out so we have 6 raised to power b now then into bracket here we are left with 6 raised to power k then minus 1 from here which is equals to 1260 then we can also write 1260 as a product of two numbers and uh, we can separate it as 36 multiplied by 35 then from here that will be equals to 6 raised to power b into bracket 6 raised to power k minus 1 from here which is equals to 36 times 35 and then uh, from here this is of course will be an even number this is an odd number and uh, also this is even from here and this is odd also from here then let's compare this that means we can equate 6 raised to power b as 36 so we have 6 raised to power b now 6 raised to power b let's equate that as 36 and uh, also from here 6 raised to power k minus 1 equals to 35 we equate this together and from here we can write this as 6 raised to power b equals to 6 square 6 square 6 times 6 that's 36 then the base are equal let's equate the power so b here is equals to 2 and also on this side let's take one to this side become plus that means we have 6 raised to power k equals to 35 plus 1 that's 36 also from here 6 raised to power k equals to 6 square also k is equals to 2 from here then we can get our a now since we say a should be equals to b plus k then a from here will then be equals to 2 plus 2 so a will be equals to 4 from here so a is equals to 4 so we can say therefore from here a will be equals to 4 and b is equals to 2 now to confirm from the equation we are given we have 6 raised to power a minus 6 raised to power b is equals to 1260 now to confirm from here we substitute a equals to 4 so we can write this as 6 raised to power 4 minus 6 b as 2 c square is this giving us 1260 from here then 6 raised to power 4 means 6 multiply itself 4 times so that gives us 1296 then minus c squared that's 36 will this give us 1260 from here then of course when we subtract this this give us 
1,260, which is equal to 1,260. It implies that the left hand side equals to the right hand side. Then we conclude that A is equal to 4 and B is equal to 2 to satisfy this given problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos and also turn the notification bell on. Share this video, put your comment. See you next class then. Bye for now.